Beaches may be closed, but Hampton is still open for business. We're all open and you can still walk along even though you can't have your feet in the sand. You can still walk along the boardwalk and still enjoy the salt air. It's a much different Memorial Day weekend than the businesses and customers are used to, but there are still plenty of families on the boardwalk taking in the ocean view and dining at the restaurants and shopping in the stores. I'm getting phone calls all the time. I need Hampton Beach. I need my Hampton Beach. Uh, we have a lot of people excited that things are open, so they're coming down just to say hi. Very few people trying to get on the beach today, but it's no surprise with the cooler temperatures. But yesterday and even into the evening, police did have to move several groups along. We, we got cooperation once we uh, come up to the people and let them know that you're violating a governor's order and they exited the beach pretty quickly. Probably about 20 to 25 people we dealt with uh, violating the governor's order. This is just the start of the summer season and the beginning of the reopening phase. Business owners are working with the state to comply with the new guidelines to keep people safe as they welcome them back. The more customers, the better. We have plenty of parking. And we're just excited that we're moving forward and getting ready for phase. We're in phase one, we're getting ready for phase two. As we progress through the opening, that we do it well and we're not looking at a situation where we got to close it back down again. Nobody wants to see that. Police say they plan to continue to educate people about the order and remind them that they will soon be able to walk on the sand and swim starting June 1st. Reporting in Hampton, Siobhan Lopez, WMUR News 9.